Hi, I'm Ashley, and this is how to pronounce the R vowel sound, not the consonant sound, but the vowel sound, in a standard British English accent. So the R vowel sound is pronounced with the lips open, relaxed open, the jaw maybe just a little bit lower than you're used to having it, because there's a bit more vertical space inside the mouth, there's a bit more space between your bottom jaw and your tongue and your, the roof of your mouth. You could also think about there being space between your uh, bottom teeth and your top teeth, so the jaw's a little bit more open. Tip of the tongue, as always, is behind the back of the bottom teeth, and importantly, the back of the tongue is really quite low in the back of the mouth, so there's lots and lots of what I call vertical space. And this vowel sound is long. It's not a short sound, it's a long sound. So have a listen to this. Ah. Ah. Now, there are some uh, things to consider, just one, one particular thing to consider about the spelling of this, um, particularly when it's in an A-L combination in a word like calm. Notice that I'm not pronouncing the L, calm. And I talk much more about this in the extended resources which you can download uh, after you finish watching this lesson. So here are some examples. Staff path, class, glass, far, star, bar, part, half, calm, balm, almond, Sergeant, heart, half, ah. I start work in March. I've moved into my apartment, and Charles has asked me to marry him. You've grasped the basics but the task is asking for more creativity. The answers are advanced. If you are endlessly searching on YouTube for videos on British English pronunciation and intonation, then search no more. You could save hours of time by heading over to our website where we've got everything you need all in one place. Free videos on every topic, extended resources with audio to help you practice offline, and access to our certified coaches who can give you an expert assessment and on-demand, ongoing feedback with your progress. So if you want to start speaking English with more clarity and more confidence, then click this link and I'll see you there.